Hello everyone, I am Stephanie here at William B. Harlan Memorial Library and today I'm going to show everyone how to make these cute sea creatures that I found on Pinterest. Look how cute this one is. So to get started, I'm going to tell you what you'll need. You will need a sea creature template that you can find online and you can use any one you want. Now, I've chose the octopus because he's cute. You can do a seahorse, a fish, just whatever you want. But I've chosen this guy. Next, you will need some of this foam paper and you can use any color too you want. You will need some eyeballs for your creature and some of these jewels they are very cute or sequins, just whatever you want to use to decorate your sea creature with. You'll need some glue, a pair of scissors. You'll also need some string to hang your creature up with to decorate and a hole puncher. Now, first you're gonna take your foam paper and take your template and put down on the foam paper and then take a Sharpie, just whatever you have available and trace around your template. I've almost got it halfway traced. Now, then when you get it finished traced, tracing you will cut it out and of course I have already got one cut out now on this side you can still see my lines so I'm going to flip it over to where you don't see my lines and that's the side that I'm going to decorate so first I'm going to glue the eyes on Put two dots for the eyeballs. And then I'm just going to choose some jewels just to glue on my octopus. And you can do them any way you want to. The, your jewels. Of course, I see all kinds of seashells, and that's what I'm going to use. And leaves. I've even got butterflies in here. I can decorate with the butterfly. And two, I can put, I'm going to give them a mouth right here in the center of the eyes, just right down below them. You can see what I've done so far. The jewels are not dry, so they may fall off, so you have to be very careful, and you will have to let the jewels, the eyeballs, dry. And I may add a few more. Some more jewels to him. And they, there we go. So next, I'm going to take my hole puncher, punch a small hole up here at the top top of his head 
and then just run a piece of string through the top. That way you can hang your sea creature up. And like I said, you could do any sea creature that you want. You can do a seahorse, a fish, Maybe even a shark if you want to. Here, my octopus. Hope you all get to make one of these. Thank you for listening and be safe.